Spencer, I noticed that you uh, seem to really emphasize the change up today. You threw it a couple of times deeper in counts. Um, is that a pitch that you kind of wanted to make a point of saying, when I get into a tight spot, I want to be able to finish at bats with it? And can you kind of just talk about uh, the overall progression of the pitch? Right. Um, yeah, I mean, seven of nine were lefties today, so I knew going in that I was going to use it a lot. Um, and then just overall, I think that's a pitch that I lost feel for. I don't know where it went last year. But then to have it back now is great. So, um, I mean, it's a it's a good weapon for me. And I think moving forward, I'll probably try to rely on it more. Uh, you said uh, throughout you lost feel for it uh, last year. Um, is there anything that specifically went back into you to kind of regaining uh, a feel for that or regaining a confidence in the pitch? Mm, it was no nothing grip wise or mechanics wise or anything really changed on it. I think it was more just cleaning up my delivery overall um, and get in a little bit more consistent release point maybe. Um, so I think a lot of it had to do with, you know, maybe the shoulder thing last year or just it being a weird year in general um, as to why it kind of left me. Uh, but yeah, I'm, I'm happy with where it's at, where it's at right now and uh, how it's feeling. Thanks. We'll go to Matt Breen and then Matt Gill. Hey, Spencer. Now that you've, you've made two starts, how do you, is it like night and day from this spring to where you were last summer? Just how you feel? Yeah, it's not even close. Um, this is the best I felt physically in a long time. Um, I mean, everything just feels like it's moving good. Uh, and I'm just going to stick to my routine and try to ride this out. And Matt Moore was, you know, a decade ago was the top prospect. Um, you know, went through a lot of similar things that you, you're probably facing. Did you ever pick his brain at all? And uh, you think you've been around him this spring? Right. So I haven't been in the same throwing groups. I mean, everything's all separated because of COVID stuff. So I haven't been in the same throwing group as him, which is kind of where we all get to hang out and chat. Um, but I can say that he's a super, super nice dude. And I like him a lot. So um, if that helps <laughs> at all. <laughs> That's good enough. And your, your slider, you threw the change up a lot. You talked about that, but you haven't thrown the slider much this spring. Is that just you, you, you not need to work on that right now? Um, it's like your go to pitch anyway? Yeah, I threw a handful today. Um, I think for me, if my mechanics feel good overall, then everything is kind of cleaned up. And it's the same um, when I get ahead of myself, is kind of the same with every pitch. So, uh, and that's typically a pitch that I feel pretty comfortable throwing my slider. Um, and even when my mechanics are a little bit off, it's still a competitive miss. Whereas um, with my curveball, let's say, if my mechanics don't feel on point, um, then the misses are bigger. So that's the slider is just kind of like a, I can lean on it if I have to sort of pitch. Um, and it it's probably more of a slider to righties type day or type pitch. Um, and then today was mostly lefties in the lineup. So I only threw a couple today. I don't think I threw a single one in my first appearance, um, but that's just coincidence. It's not because I'm uh, discarding it or anything. Cool. Thanks, Spencer. Mm -hmm. Hey, Spencer, you talked about hip mobility and that's something you had focused on in the off season. Where do you, where does that manifest the most right now? Like, where do you feel that the most uh, in, in your, in your movement? Uh, I think it's just being able to get all the way through pitches and get, extension out front. Um, I think for the majority of last year, I couldn't really clear my back hip, if that makes sense. Um, and so a lot of my movement was rotational. And so this year I feel like if I do everything correctly, like just pitching wise, what I'm supposed to do, my body can get into the positions that it's, that it needs to get into. And what was it like? Uh, I'm just curious, like working with Jeff Mathis today, he's, he's been in this game for a long time. I know he's been in it a long, long time. Uh, he's a very calming presence. Uh, he made a stellar uh, mound visit there in that last inning. Um, but yeah, just overall great dude. Thank you. All right, there's no further uh, questions. Spencer, we'll let you go. Thank you. Everybody. Thanks everybody. Um, there will be a separate link set out, sent out for uh, any player availabilities as they come out. Uh, which will include also Joe's post game link. So it'll be one more link for the day and just keep an eye out for that. Thank you. Thanks, Kenny.
Thanks.